Hi guys, it's Krista from LCRC. Today we're going to talk about the battery basics when purchasing a Traxxas RC car. Although there is so much more to learn about batteries for RC cars, in the simplest terms you have two basic options. Nickel metal batteries or LiPo. In this video we're going to discuss the nickel metal batteries. Nickel metal batteries have been around for a long time and I am often able to best describe the battery as being the same one that may have come in an old power drill that you had. Just like that old power drill battery, the nickel metal batteries for RC cars are popular because they're pretty inexpensive to replace, but there are some downsides too. When you're using a nickel metal, metal battery, as you use the energy in the battery, the car will go slower and slower, just like that old power drill would slow down and go slower as it went dead. Nickel metal batteries also have a limited lifetime. They typically can only be recharged up to 100 times, and then they'll no longer take a recharge and need to be replaced. Nickel metal batteries also like to be fully charged and then fully discharged. So you wouldn't want to let one laying around that is charged up and you don't want to interrupt it mid-charge. If you purchase a Traxxas RC car that comes with a nickel metal battery, that's also going to include a car charger or a charger that plugs into the cigarette lighter in your automobile. This charger is a 4 amp charger, so it's the equivalent of an Easy Peak charger. There is also an economical wall charger for nickel metal batteries, but it's a two amp charger, so it's gonna take about double the time to charge that battery. You can always um, also upgrade to an Easy Peak charger, which will charge that nickel metal battery at four amps. It also can do LiPo batteries, so if you ever decide that you wanna upgrade batteries, it will be able to also charge that option. When we're talking about batteries, there are many options as far as sizing. The milliamp, or MAH number, represents the length of time the battery will last on one charge. Or, thought of another way, it's the fuel tank of the car. The bigger the number, the longer that battery will run. 